Howdy with this video. I want to show you how to do journals 10 through 12. We're going to do this a little bit differently and do these on the discussion board. Uh, the assignment for them, I have emailed you through a D2, D2L email attachment, and they're also up here on the content page under journal entries. Uh, right there's journal 10, 10 through 12. Uh, I already have it pulled up on my computer. Uh, but again, with these, you're going to do uh, three posts on the discussion board. Uh, when you do your post, make sure you uh, label which uh, journal you're, you're attempting to do on the discussion board. So we all know what you're doing there. Uh, but for uh, number 10, uh, I want you to look at the e-portfolios of the people whose essays you reviewed for the APA medical essay and just comment on your e-portfolios and you know, be out for some encouraging words and uh, be positive there. And there's a list of uh, the peer reviews there. Uh, for number 11, kind of want you to think about the class, uh, what worked well for you, what kind of approaches to learning uh, uh, were successful for this condensed internet class. How might those carry over to uh, uh, other internet classes that you might be taking in the future? And with the COVID situation, most people are probably going to be in one uh, one type of internet class or another. Uh, also asking if you, you know, if some other teacher had this wildly successful approach, <coughs> please let me know because uh, I want to know. <laughs> I don't always get to talk to a lot of other instructors, so it's good to know what they're doing as well. And kind of going back to that journal two and the profile, the self-regulator, self-regulated learner profile points, and seeing uh, what worked there or what you could improve on a little bit. Uh, then for number twelve, I want you to respond to the post of another student. Uh, you can talk about things that work for you well this semester, or if you're going for a similar career, you can talk about that. Uh, you might have some future competition for the nursing program. Uh, but it's also good to have uh, uh, help with uh, these kind of the classes you're taking to get to those programs too, uh, and know somebody else in there. Uh, but each one of these posts should be 150 words. <coughs> uh, don't be positive. Uh, when you're talking about other people, make sure you're being professional. Don't talk about how they, how they look or anything like that. Uh, that's not what we're here for. Uh, but uh, when you're ready to start posting, uh, the discussion boards are up here under discussions. We'll click on the discussion. These might look a little different because I created the board. Uh, but you'll just click on the discussion board here under journals 10 through 12. Uh, there's different ways you can do this. Uh, one, there's different ways to work with settings and the appearance of the discussion board. I don't encourage you to do that because this is the only one we're doing. And uh, by the time you figure it out, it's over and then you'll forget. Uh, <laughs> by the time you use it the next time, probably. Um, but, uh, <coughs> shoot, I'm in my office here at Northeast State, and the air is just, uh, it's recirculated, I guess is a good word. Uh, you can do it like this. Uh, Shay, uh, Sandra, uh, put all of hers into one post. Uh, once you get a bunch of people posting, that's a little easier to do. Uh, but notice she kind of said, I'm doing Journal 10 here, doing Journal 11 here, doing Journal 12 here. Uh, if you don't have that kind of time, go back to view the topic. <coughs> uh, you can do it one at a time like uh, Elizabeth here is doing. She's posted her journal number 11 and uh, it looks like somebody's replied to it. Looks like Daryl's replied to it. Um, but again, each one of these should be 150 words. Uh, there's Daryl responding to the post of another student. Uh, and hopefully it's pretty easy to kind of see who's responding to who and what people are saying. And again, once you get a bunch of people getting on there, it's a lot easier to respond and be able to complete the assignment. Uh, but you're just going to, if you're not sure how to do it, well, where'd it go? You can just hit reply to thread and you can reply to the person you're, who's already posted. Uh, you can also, start a new thread if you want to, if you want to, if you have like a, a, a different idea from everybody else or you just want to. Uh, be your own person. Uh, you can start a new thread as well. Either way you want to do it. Uh, but that's where the discussion board is. And that's where you're going to be doing journals 10 through 12. If you have any questions about it, be sure and let me know. But we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.